y'all, it is time for another video. But not just any video. This is a Christmas video that I have been wanting to do forever. So, here we go. Okay, y'all, this video is going to be a little different, but like I said in the intro, I've been wanting to do this for years. This is my pink Christmas. <laughs> I'm so excited. I have a pink Christmas tree and I'm gonna show you everything and all kinds of goodies. And I've always wanted to have a pink Christmas for my dollies and a big pink Christmas tree because I love pink, pinky, pinky, pink. You guys should know that by now. So what I'm gonna do, is take the bags, move them to the side, and then pick from them and show you all the stuff I got and then decorate the pink Christmas tree. Plus, I have custom dollies that I did that are gonna help us with this pink Christmas. Look at these. These were so vintage and so cute. I got another one. They were half off because everything Christmas was half off at Hobby Lobby, so it didn't cost $19.99, it was $9. But my dad got me these because I just loved them. And I went through every single one, just like I do the dolls, to make sure I got the one with the best paint. And I thought this could be something really cute in the background for us, for my pink Christmas. And here's the pink one. Oh my God, isn't it the cutest? It's so pink and I love the vintage look of it. I love stuff like this. This is so me, like 50s pink and teal Christmas. This is so perfect and I just love it. And it was the same, I just cut the tag off of it. It was $19.99, but half off at Hobby Lobby. Now here is my tree and it's too big for the way I've got my setup right now, but I'm gonna lift my setup so you guys can see it. But just look at this pink loveliness. Look at this tree. Is it not perfect for the dolls and perfect for me? Now, it was $9.99 and it was half off. So it was like $5-ish for this tree. And I just, I just love it. It's so pink. Okay, so I fluffed and judged the tree because every branch was all like crumpled together from being, you know, in the store and whatever. But it is so cute. I'm gonna let you see it all once it's decorated. So it'll be awesome. Okay, so I got these adorable pink candy canes. They were $2.99, so they were half, so that made them $1.50 to decorate my tree. I also got this Merry Christmas sparkly sign in pink. It was the only one they had. It was a little bent, but I just had to have it, and it was half off, so it was about $2.50 because it's $4.99. So I just thought this would be super pretty to hang in the background of our pink Christmas. Okay, that's better. I raised the setup a little more so it's almost to the top of the tree. The top of the tree is just that much taller, so yay. And next, I got this. Oh my goodness, if you had touch a vision if you have a Hobby Lobby and they still have one of these, because they didn't have very many, go touch it. It's so, so soft, but it was $5.99 half off. This is my tree skirt for my pink tree. I am loving all this pink. I'm in pink overload. I'm so happy with all of this stuff. And the tree is just gonna be beautiful. I just know it. Next, I got these bulb ornaments in the tealy color. This is like my second kind of favorite color. It's, it's not exact. It's more like this, but more pale but you know this was as close as they had and I also got the pink ones because you know I love pink and I have to have pink on my tree but I wanted to have an accent color so I picked the tealy blue and these were $3.99 a piece which made them about two dollars each so I didn't think that was too bad for um what is that eight ornaments each so that's not bad next I went over to the ribbon section because I couldn't find any you know like drape or not tinsel, garland is what I'm trying to think of for the tree. So I got these. This one was $3.99, this one was $2.99, and they were half off in my pink and teal colors for my tree. So I'm going to, you know, do something, zhuzh this, and make it fancy for my tree. So yay! And I also got these pink beads to decorate the tree again. This stuff was half off too, even though it wasn't Christmas. Um, I made sure of that. So I got these to make the tree pretty and they're coming across a little like orangey to me um, through my viewfinder, but these are definitely a blush pink. They are so pretty and I love them. Super cute. 
I also could not resist these. I thought these were super adorable and so pink and sparkly. Again, half off, $2.99, which made these about a buck fifty for all these little ornaments. 12 little ornaments, so, so cute. And to top off our pink Christmas, this little tree topper was $4.99, which made it about $2.50. I just thought this was perfect for me. It is so cute. I was gonna make a little angel, and then I saw this, and I thought, nope, this is it. This is perfect. This is vintage looking with the little scrolly thing here. I just absolutely love it for my pink Christmas tree, and I'm so happy for all these decorations. I can't wait to decorate the tree for y'all. And from Dollar Tree, I scored these. These are so cute. Look at these, y'all. There's 16 of these, and they're pink, pinky, pinky, pink. So cute. I thought these would round out the other ornaments I got from Hobby Lobby for my beautiful pink Christmas tree, and I just can't wait to decorate this. I know I've said that like 50 million times, but I'm so excited. And lastly, I know this is gonna look weird. These are lights for the tree, and yes, the string is pink. And I got these at Valentine's because I knew that I wanted to do a pink Christmas tree and I got these from Dollar Tree and I knew these would be perfect because the twine is pink and the lights are kind of pinky red and I just thought, how perfect for my pink Christmas. And so I grabbed them. So now what I'm gonna do is stop here, decorate my tree and then come back when it's all finished and pretty and show you all. Plus I have two little Christmas helpers that I made for this video especially that have pink Christmas outfits. OOAKs, I've been wanting to do this for forever too and I got them finished this year in time. So I can't wait to show them to you. I hope you guys love all of this. My big pink, pinky pink Christmas. Okay y'all, for you that took seconds. For me, it actually took hours because I had to string each one of these ornaments and get it just right and let you see the whole tree. It's so pretty, y'all. So you can see my pretty pink Christmas tree. Pink, pinky pink. I'm so happy with it. Oh, pink, so Christmas. Now, to show you the creations I made, we have this girl, and oh my God, I love her so much. I gave her one of the little pink candy canes. I have been wanting to do pink Christmas dolls for so long and you can never find fabric that's pink. So what I did is I used, this is ribbon, because I found this awesome ribbon. Look at this. Isn't it adorable? I found this ribbon and I thought, you know what? Dolls are small. I am going to make some pink Christmas. Just look at all of this. I just, I so love it. I use snaps on everything. Most of it is hand sewn. Um, some things I did um, glue on like the little palms, but you know, I sewed everything else. I took the ribbon and put three pieces to make it into a triangle to make this hat. And I doubled this over and it was wire edged ribbon. So I kept the wire in this part and in this part to ruche it but then I sewed it. This I took the wire out of up here, but I kept it in up here to ruche it. So, you know, you can do all kinds of things with things that, you know, aren't meant to be used as fabric for doll clothing, but I just, I love every bit of this. I had such a good time. I did snaps on everything. You can see the snaps. It took a while. Um, I've been doing a lot of sewing for y'all, so I hope you're gonna love everything that I did. But I just thought, look at her with the pink Christmas tree. Just, is that not the cutest thing? Oh my goodness, I just, I so love her. I think she's my favorite, but I'm not sure because I've done a lot. I've done a lot of Christmas sewing, so there's more videos. I'm gonna have an a-thon for you of videos. Um, I'm gonna try and do at least three of the Christmas videos I wanted to do for you guys, and this was one of them. This has been in my heart for a long time, the pink Christmas tree. I know it might be silly to some people, but to me, I just love it, and I always wanted to have a pink Christmas tree for my dolls because I love pink, pink, pinky pink, and I love this doll. She's one that I got that had chopped hair and I fixed the hairdo. I fixed her a while ago and I just love her. I love her face and I just think this is perfect on her. I might never take it off of her to be quite honest. I love her this way and I just think this is so cute with the pink candy cane. Now these shoes, I didn't do anything to the shoes. 
I just had these and I threw these on her. I did have ideas for, you know, doing more things, but I've been trying to do as much as I can to make things how I want them and then show them to you guys. So here is her and I did another one. So there's another pink Christmas girl. I put her there in the background. So it looks like she's decorating the tree. Oh my God, my pink heart right now and my doll collector heart and everything that I love is all right here. This is so awesome, y'all. But I also did this cutie. Remember how I told you guys I just couldn't resist these awesome hair adorable, hair amazing new ones that are only $5. I brushed out her hair just real quick. Look at this hair now that it's brushed out. Look at my hands just go glide right through it. Look at how amazing it is. I know that's funny, haha, -ha, hair amazing, but she's gorgeous and she had this tealy hair and I found this. This is also ribbon because like I said, I couldn't find any pink fabric. I looked and looked and looked and I just, I didn't want to run out of time and I wanted to make my pink tree this year and have a pink, pinky pink Christmas with y'all. So I just had to do this. I found this ribbon at um, Joann's. Now this is kind of a convert dress because you can, have it like that where they're down or you can have it up like this where it looks more like sleeves either way you like plus there's little palms in there I just I love all the little details you know me guys and all the details I just love everything pink and everything Christmassy together I did this little foofy bow and the little buttons and I did do snaps on the skirt and on um the top there because it's two pieces on this as well as that one over there and I embellished it with more palms and little buttons and this I made this little bow by hand and then stuck it in her head with you know a push pin kind of thing but I just thought she was so sweet and so cute this way and just this goes perfectly with her hair to me this ribbon and when I saw it I knew I was gonna make an outfit for her and I did three tiers of the ribbon to make the skirt that's how I made it because this right here is how wide the ribbon is right here at the top I used the whole thing for the top of her and then I you know made darts you can see the darts there kind of but I covered them up with the pom-poms because I just thought that was really cute and I know she's not overly articulated and I stole her shoes because she was a mermaid so I stole the shoes from another doll so that she could have some shoes because like I said I always want to do more and I can't and I want to do as much as I can of how I have it envisioned in my brain for you guys so here this one is this beautiful hair amazing and I'm so happy with my pink Christmas that I got to share with you guys I hope you enjoyed it I know this is a little bit of a different video it was kind of a haul and kind of you know strange but I just wanted to have a pink Christmas with y'all so I did Okay, so there's my pink, pinky pink Christmas that I got to share with you guys. I hope you enjoyed all of my work here. I did so much work on these and it was all hand done and I just had so much fun and I just wanted to share that with you. So I hope that you guys appreciate it as much as I do and enjoy it as a doll collector. You know, our doll collector hearts all have different things that we like, but I wanted to share this with y'all. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for being with me and for watching. Have a great Christmas. I will see you soon because I'm going to film more videos. As always, I hope that everyone watching is well and happy and safe this season. And that all the best things, the best dolly days and the best dolly presents that can come to you, I truly hope that they do and will. I have to say, oh my goodness, woo! Big ol' subscriber love to all you lovely subscribers. Oh my goodness, our numbers have gone up. We are almost at a thousand. I cannot even believe it. It blows my mind. Thank you guys so much. You guys are the best for coming along this journey and saying, hey, we like your dolly silliness and your craziness and we enjoy all the silly stuff that you do. So thank you so much for that. I really do appreciate it 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 goes straight to my dolly collector heart so thank y'all if you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for we have pink galore nobody else has as much pink as me for the dollies i just know it because i love it so much but everyone is always welcome here we're building this great big dolly barbie youtube family and we do all kinds of dolly silliness so come on join us see what holiday dolly silliness and craziness we get up to well y'all that's all for my big pinky pink christmas video so you know what i'm gonna say merry christmas bye y'all